Hello everybody, my name is Jerbear, and recently I've been theorizing, uh, hypothetically speaking, about the future of Overwatch and what Blizzard can possibly do with it. Um, of course, it just came out, so you're probably asking, why am I thinking about this now? Well, a couple of things. You know, the future of a game is very, very important, especially after it launches um, from seeing where the popularity goes. As you can tell, a lot of Blizzard games, they do very, very well for a very, very good amount of time. And now that they're releasing uh, Overwatch as a buy-to-play, could it be possible in the future to see it go free-to-play? There's a lot of things that can happen as a game evolves. Uh, the community changes, the scene changes, as the game changes uh, over the years. So, what could it possibly do to go free-to-play? Or how could Blizzard prevent it from going free-to-play? Not that free-to-play is a bad thing, of course. You know, there's multiple options of what you can choose for your game. But transitioning a game from buy-to-play to free-to-play free or even pay-to-play to free-to-play free free or whatever you want to call it, whatever different ways there's, there's possibly to choose, it's all about choosing the right option for your game. You know, if you, you first start out by pay-to-play and you see that it's not really working, well, you need to change something. You really need to make sure that you can optimally choose the best option for your game and your, your audience, your target audience. So looking at what the target audience that Overwatch has, it's very much of like the shooter and people who enjoy MOBAs and you know games like League of Legends and Dota 2 or Team Fortress 2, whatever it is. Games like that, um, they're mostly free to play. Now, Overwatch does a very, very great job of offering a lot of quality content for a buy to play game that's in this scene. And for Blizzard to keep this pay to play or buy to play rather, they would have to do something that I think could make this game a lot better. They can, the entire scene can be a lot better. And that's pushing the competitive scene. Right now, we don't have ranked play in the game. Uh, if you're watching at a different time, it may change, but I'm not sure. But as of right now, there's no ranked play, and that's kind of, it's not as hardcore as a league that I would like to see be implemented in the future. Uh, similar to how Riot does it, even Valve, how they do it now, they're starting to develop a league for Counter-Strike. If they were able to develop a league for this game, they could do very, very well with it. There's a lot of things that go into this league, and developing a really, really good one, an organized schedule and everything. Uh, obviously, it would take some time to get all the kinks out and try and organize a, a league, but I think it can really help. It can promote them a lot, and I would need them to not do it how they work Heroes of the Storm competitive scene. Blizzard... Uh, my opinion, of course, I think Blizzard did not do a great job of how they run the competitive scene with Heroes, uh, Heroes of the Storm. Now, I watched Jesse Cox's uh, video of him, you know, running a team in that league, and by the sounds of it, it sounds very, very scary. I, I don't know how else to, to put it, but they need to do it differently. Obviously, it's a different branch of Blizzard. Um, they're taking it from, their, it's Overwatch. But if they can make a league, that would make this game that much better. It would give people to something to look at and enjoy themselves. You know, watching as entertaining, uh, playing some games on the side while watching the newest matches of the weekend or something like that. You know, that would be really, really cool. Uh, good ways to implement competitive scene with casual play that promotes your game very, very well. And they need to do a very, they need to do a good job of it. They need to get, they need to flush it out. It needs to be very, very well run. Um, along with that, there needs to be constant flow of content. Um, obviously, looking at something like World of Warcraft, where you're kind of pathetic of what they're doing currently with Warlords. Uh, obviously, it's a different game. Like I said, it's Overwatch, but they would need a constant flow of content. Well, I'm not sure what it, if, if it's uh, new maps, um, new game modes, new heroes, whatever it is. They would need a constant flow of that. They would need to keep moving content keep pushing content into the players face or whatever so that would be cool like i said since there's no ranked play at the moment i would love to see rank play very very soon that would give a lot of people the push to um actually try to get really really good at the game not just in quick play or brawl or whatever uh rank play is a great thing along with that could blizzard uh, transition overwatch to free to play without any problems I'm not sure it could be very very hard it could be a great thing for the game 
they might just say pay to play because of what we've seen with all of their other games and how they have not really ever changed uh world of warcraft being probably the major one that a lot of people want to see change from free to play go to free to play from pay to play uh we see heroes of storm starting off free to play as well as hearthstone so they have that under the belt they understand microtransactions of course there's some of those in world of warcraft as well and then you got diablo and uh starcraft that are the other buy to play games under their belt so there's a lot of things that they can implement by looking at all their different types of games and i think that if it went free to play they would do a very very good job uh, if it says buy to play i think they'll still do a great job just seen by the pure mass of popularity that the game has at this very moment it's a great game uh, of course we're gonna have to see how it does in the future but as of right now i'm just bringing this up because i like to theorize and uh would love to see something in the future change of course you know why not free to play is the future in my opinion just saying hopefully you guys enjoyed it let me know if you guys think that this game will go free to play in anywhere in the near future if not let me know as well um hope you guys enjoyed it for that reason follow me on our social media and i'll see you guys in the next one